love the chase and the hunt And I set the pace when I'm running I always take what I want and I always give it 100 Don't need a bank, no I'm funded Play the game like it's nothing I'm always thankful for something Don't take for granted, stay humble Now wake up! It's time to look at the enemy Look in the mirror if he is no friend to me It's not working out, maybe it's the chemistry It's time to break up so I can make a better me Better believe in your mind cause it's everything You can mold shape, find almost anything All it takes is some time and some clarity To find your identity, it's mind over everything the tank is like extremely cloudy and I know I'm like a little dark still working on the whole positioning thing and right now I'm sitting on the floor I just spent what I think it was since 8 o'clock yeah and it's 12 now p.m. or a.m. I should say I just spent a lot of hours basically cleaning up the tank um I don't know if you can notice on the, I don't know if you can see it on the video um, right now, but there's a bunch of hair algae. I did not think I was gonna ever get hair algae, but I did. So I just got done cleaning up a lot of the hair algae, scraping the back glass, which was a pain in the ass, oh my God. So I just scraped out a lot of the algae off the back. It was really, really hard to scrape. I also just did a water change and then come to find out I moved my RO system to a new location and it's producing a very high amount of phosphate. So after going through the filtration and getting mixed with salt, it pulls out a phosphate level of 0 0.55. Hmm. Yeah, it's, that's extremely high. So, went to go get some GFO. Definitely about to put one onto the RO system to lower the phosphate. I don't want any as of right now. I'd rather it be introduced into the tank when I feed them. So as you, I mean, I don't know if I can explain this correctly, but phosphate is, um, you know, I'll get back to you on it. Actually, I'm not even gonna try to explain it. So, yeah. Right now the tank is cloudy, it's in, it's in its little recovery mode, but one thing that I did notice was as soon as I did this water change, mind you the GFO, which is supposed to be removing a lot of the phosphate, is in the tank now. When I did this water change, all the coral decided to open up. They were like, whoa, air, oxygen, oh my God, we can breathe. So besides my, that right there is actually supposed to be the bubble tip of the enemy. 
it's moved quite a bit. Um, so it's a little shaken up. And then I finally got the carpet out of the container that I had it in, sitting there in recovery mode. And now it's attached to the rock, doing pretty good. Unfortunately, I did buy some, um, oh, what were they, Galaxia. And then the outbreak of algae happened and it kind of smothered and killed the hell out of it. So the Galaxia is dead, unfortunately. Um, I lost my sea urchin. Oh, I'm so mad about that. I do love my sea urchins. I really do. Um, the starfish is still alive. The chocolate chip starfish, which he's been tearing up this algae. He's been helping, you know, putting his little two steps in. So I can't be mad at him. Um, as long as he stays off of my coral. But yeah. So like I said, as of right now, as of right now, the tank is in kind of this little recovery mode. It's a little cloudy. It'll clear up, I'm pretty sure. Um, and hopefully we'll bounce out of this ugly phase, I guess you call it. It's kind of late in the game to have one, but I guess there's no there's no real time frame for an ugly phase. It can happen whenever. Um, but yeah. So, I mean, stay tuned for another video. I know I'm super late on loading them. I be tired. Shoot, like, I be tired. I really do. I throw the, I throw the camera in the tank and then be like, okay, here's a video. And I don't feel like talking. So, I'm gonna try and keep up with the talking and keep going, but I need your feedback. I would love it. I would love other fish friends. So, you know, hit me up. Let me know what you did, what I'm doing. Is it something that you wouldn't want to do and why that would be? I would love to, to you know, hear that feedback and get get all of it. Um, I will be coming up on the 27th, going up to Georgia to help move a fish tank. And I'm gonna try to record every bit of it so I can, you know, load the video up and you, like, you guys can see how it goes and hopefully we don't get pulled over. I don't want that again. But yeah, you'll see and I'm, I'm gonna load that soon. So thank you guys for watching. Um, as I said, stay tuned for more videos. Hey, what's up guys? So I'm sitting here in front of the tank again. <sighs> Didn't feel like doing all the setup. I literally am tired. Um, as you can see, you know, tank is in recovery mode and it's gonna be that way for a minute. Uh, I got a filter on here, so it probably looks pretty clear at this point, but trust me, it is not clear. Um, but yeah. I'm into a new, I guess I'm doing a new update. I'm gonna call this a new update of the rebuild, the re-up, the revamp, whatever you wanna call it. I'm in this ugly phase right now and yeah, it's kind of my fault. So I got busy with work, busy with life again, um, new job, trying to move all this mess. And I kind of neglected the tank, I know. Well, in result, I end up losing a sea urchin, which I am so sad and I hate losing sea urchins. It is like the worst feeling ever. And it's the, the worst smell ever. So I end up losing a sea urchin and a coral, which I hate losing coral too. I hate losing anything. I don't like losing. I don't I don't like it. I don't like it. I mean I'm a I'm a great loser. I mean don't get me wrong, but I don't like losing. It's just not meant for me, you know? I'm still working on the, the camera image quality thing. Bear with me. But um, I just wanted to make sure I gave out another video because I, for myself, I want to make sure I document it all and be able to look back on it and be like, hey, that's where I started at? All those mess ups? Oh my God. It took me so long to get to that point. So yeah, I just want to go back and look at it and remember the times, you know. But anyway, um, I'm gonna, like I said, I'm gonna try and keep up with these videos and posting them and hopefully people enjoy them. If not, I mean, they don't, they don't. I don't hey, that's up to you, can't worry. But yeah, I'm gonna keep posting them and don't, 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 don't worry about this. It literally, like when I tell you, I, I don't feel like doing nothing. I don't. <laughs> so this cut 
soon coming with some good videos but yeah um i'll keep you updated you know like i said if you want to reach out reach out go ahead i'm all for it um i'm also going to still be loading the videos to youtube for some reason with this camera um it's really hard to load it to um instagram from transitioning from editing the ed the edit version to my phone to load it to instagram it'd be great if i could load stuff from instagram i mean from my computer to instagram i haven't figured that out yet so once i do <laughs> trust me that is exactly what's going to be done i do like the video quality on instagram better than facebook but for the moment right now, it's going to go to Facebook and then go to YouTube. So, yeah, be looking at be looking out for a new video on fa on my Facebook and also on um, me and Babe's uh, YouTube that we share together. Um, yeah, that's kind of everything that I have right now. Just a quick little get at your high. Ugh. I don't know. <laughs> Just a little video. So, yeah, I'll see you guys soon. From the heathen sky, we don't got fight, got pride, got reason